and welcome back to Terra Tech with me, Tenzin. How's everybody doing today? Thanks for coming back. Um, so today I think we were just gonna we're just gonna do a nice little short video on harvesting. As you can see, got quite a bit of money here. Um, we picked a pretty good place to set up camp and build a base. With well, there's not like a giant amount of resources, but the resources we do have are pay for or get us quite a bit of money. So here's the base so far. I did have two delivery cannons here, but there is a glitch. So when you have two delivery cannons side by side, when it goes to shoot one off or cash it in, it actually just switches over and you keep getting the money over and over and over. So that's kind of how we got that money. Um, I will be reporting that bug. Um, but yeah, so essentially we have our delivery systems here. We pull in, offload, goes in, goes to our refineries, our refineries then go to our delivery cannons and we'll, you know, we're just making bank. Um, I think after this we're going to remove these delivery cannons and we will actually put the foundries in and maybe the fabricators. I think the fabricators. What's the fabricator? Fabricator takes two refined, unrefined resources chunks and crafts them into a block. Okay. And a foundry. A foundry allows the creation of alloys by fusing two refined. So we'll probably go with the uh, fabricators, and we'll just have this sitting close to the end, and hopefully it just grabs the pieces as they go. But here's our vehicle, our harvesting vehicle. So we went with the GSO um, collector pads because they move pretty fast, or they catch pretty fast. Or sorry, you guys, I do speak English. Um, they can they can hold the resources at higher speeds compared to the uh, GEO ones. And like I said, if you watched uh, the um, the home run and uh, uh, gauntlet videos, you know that I was all excited about these wheels, which now we have. But now I'm kind of thinking that they might be cl too close to the ground. I actually like them underneath the battery. Hmm. Let's see if we can fix that really quickly without breaking a bunch of stuff. You know what? Let's zoom out. Grab this. This thing is so nice to have. Just because you can do this and not have to worry about you know having this giant pile of wheels sitting everywhere or anything like that you know you just throw them on the ground or apparently you connect them to this thing the collector okay did we get them all off yep yeah. okay the wheels so how's everybody doing today? I'm doing pretty good. I'm here with you guys doing what I like or enjoy doing. And hopefully I'm bringing the quality, bringing you guys quality videos. I'm uh, getting some new stuff in the mail to hopefully improve the microphone. I noticed you can guys can hear my creeper breathe. <laughs> That's just because I have to have it so close to my face, but hopefully in the next couple of days I'll have it fixed, and I'm always shooting for 1080p for you guys, so um, I think we're still going to tip over, I'd almost say for sure we're going to tip over. Here, let's go like this. Um, doesn't really matter because we have so much money. So I think in the next episode, next couple ones, depending on what we're doing, because we're doing re um, harvesting this this episode. But I think we are going to eventually or soon 
build something ginormous. So and we haven't had too many problems with guys spawning in. There's a lot on the horizon. And there's the odd one that spawns in right at the base, but I think we're gonna be carrying this with us also. Just because we're gonna like we can buy um what is going on here? I should be able to switch to that. Okay, let's just close that. Huh. Interesting. But, um... Like, yeah, we have a ton of money we can buy. Lots of the blocks, but... We don't have to. Why? Like so. I think we're gonna need, um some of the plow blades in the front here for the first time ever just because of what the problems we were having when we were racing there we go now that looks good all right let's go like this like that and we're off okay let's harvest some guys and some material So as you can see, I put my favorite guns on this one. <laughs> they just don't stand a chance. We're deadly. So, as if you guys watch the home run, or the gauntlet series, the home run and uh, rolling thunder, you notice there was a bunch of new, or a bunch of extra blocks that we could use that we, ha we don't have yet. So we are going to have to go in search of those. And I was thinking going like half and half kind of thing. Like, um... Half fly like half a flying machine and half a normal machine, so... Oh, we might be getting into a battle. See those big drills on the front too? I was thinking of making a harvesting machine like that also. We might, but we have to use the GEO wheels because they uh, if you put this drill bit right on the front of our vehicle right now it drag on the ground so it's a little annoying but it always gives us more and more things to think about that's a, that's what's great about this game is that you know it's your imagination that limits you so let's get this guy here holy cow there's a lot out here we might actually have to make a war machine Let's just get in nice and close to him. We still haven't found the 10 pound cannons either, so there's still that to look forward to. Um, our battery is not doing the greatest. If we go off the side here. Is he done? Yep. Okay, got some plating and stuff. Okay, we gotta run to the base, recharge, and then we'll harvest. Uh, you just can't pass these GEO guys up, really. They just, their blocks are just so big. Mm, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. <laughs> wow. That was a lot of. St Are you serious? Wow, that was a lot of stuff to pick up. Okay, let's go recharge the battery. We'll actually harvest these really quickly. Because they're right here. So this one is gone, it's just kind of. And the reason I put the plow blades on the front is because I didn't want the resources rolling underneath. It'd be nice if you could put like a directional plow blade on here, so that way you could kind of push it off to the side, but... And I'm actually surprised that it hasn't jammed us up any. 
Okay, we are charging at the moment. But I want to show you guys this. Oops. So, of course. It's just wide enough for our vehicle to fit in. And then you can see the... Well, then you guys can see how it's going through. I wish we had both sides, but we'll fix that. We'll go out, head out, and um, we'll fill up the whole truck. That should give us more than enough, and it'll be more than one side can handle. And then we can actually, I can actually show you guys how quickly it actually works. All right, I think our batteries are almost filled. Mm. Yep, we're good to go. Okay. We're out of here. Um, yeah, we're still going to bring this with us. Okay, so I've gone up in these mountains a couple of times. And there's a lot of stuff in the way. Well, not in the way, but there's a lot of resources up here. Oh, uh, come on. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Somebody was having fun. Because most of these techs, like, I, I think I've told everybody, but uh, most of these techs are other player built ones. So, if you, you can tell which ones are which by the names, but. Come on. While we're waiting. See if any of that's that. Nope. So. It's just over this ridge. As soon as we get over that ridge, we'll have plenty of resources. Mm. Come on. Oh. Just don't have the juice to get over it, huh? Something in a harvesting vehicle, it doesn't seem to really matter what the layout is. I kind of like this layout because this seems to be a little easier to drive alongside. And, and one that, you know, see that's kind of a glitchy part, but I think there's one stuck underneath us. That's why it's doing that. It's trying to get out from underneath us. Yeah. So, it doesn't seem like there's an extra range on any of them. Um, GEO has that, their super pad, but it, um, it makes it really hard to offload because it grabs harder than the uh, conveyor belt itself. Okay, there's a problem. Okay, well, can't use those. Let's go like that. Honestly, what I should have done is uh, come from the top down or directly up the center like this so that everything kind of rolls into us. Oh, we're glitching up pretty good here with the blocks trying to get out from underneath us. Yeah, we're too heavy to make it up, I think. But... Everything should roll towards us. Oh, there's quite a few of them here that... Okay. So, yeah, there's a lot of harvest, you know. I think these things might still be holding us up. A little bit. You know, we have it with us, let's just do it. We'll switch to the larger tires. Then at least I'm not, we can, uh, I'm not doing anything. I'm showing you guys what to do. <laughs> but, uh, 
that it doesn't take forever for us to get anywhere. These wheels would be great on, let's say, the desert, that flat area down below. But yeah, during, uh, with these mountains, they're not as easily, or should I say nicely, Like building a war machine with these, Whew. but you just have to be on flat ground. I do want to tinker around with more flying. I want to build some big flying machines. Um, where's our paintbrush? There we go. Tires. Um, your bog standard giant geocorp wheel. Very hard wearing. Okay, we'll just use these ones. Oops. Actually, since we did put these on, though, maybe we should put one of the big drills on the front. Ah, oh, come on. We'll put a big drill on the front and uh, we'll see what happens. So we just have to get rid of these lasers. Yeah, so the base of this whole thing is battery, uh, repair bubble, battery, battery, battery. <laughs> uh, where is... I can't see the... Uh, what happened to our tire? Okay. Yeah, it seems to be working. We'll see. It's not bad, not bad. Um, what else have we got? See, I, uh, if you remember that spot from a couple of videos ago, that's our a different landmark we have now. So we have about three landmarks. We have that giant tower, we have that giant block now, and we have our trading station. Wow. This, uh, this drill in front of us is unbelievable. Oh, I think we might be full, gentlemen and ladies, if there's any watching. Yep, we are full. Okay, let's just get rid of some of this wood. Because the wood isn't worth as much. Okay, let's head back to the base and That doesn't make any sense. They're supposed to be able to hold 20 high. So that's supposed to be 5 apiece. 1, 2, 3. That's 12. Interesting. Is it lying to us? Either way. So, that's that. We'll head back to the base now. Um... I actually like this drill. Might have to make a new vehicle using those drills. Maybe we'll put two on the front and... Uh, whoa. Look at all the drills screwing up that, or it's destroying the front tire. Come on. Oh, there's two. have to get these because we're hoarders do 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 oh 
Oh yeah. Some of the view. The, see, these are nice. These are gonna go a long ways when we decide to make that giant tech. And same with these giant wheels. So. Come on, grab it. Grab it. That way we can go like that. There's nobody around us, right? Not really. Now, obviously, these conveyors, you can use. Uh, not the conveyors, the collectors. You can use them at higher speeds, the uh, harvesting collectors. But, um. I just don't know which vehicles you're supposed to use them in. Like the GSO, these ones would be nice. But then, like when we went up into the hill there, you really can't do it, right? So it's like. Catch 22, in a sense. Like you want to move faster to harvest. Like, this is slow. But. See if we can back in it. Nope, can't even. Okay. Let's just drive her straight in, and that'll probably work for us. I'm sure that the conveyor belts can grab everything. Oh, why didn't that one? Oh, because it's already refined. That's why that one didn't go through. So sometimes you got to help them through. But. I think we got a nice system set up here. It takes a little bit to get the hang of these conveyor belts because they're really picky at the moment. But I'm sure they're going to try and fix that before they release the game. I think sometimes they'll just. They'll stop. The, the material for not going anywhere for no reason. So. But alright, this is just a short little episode, so I think I'll leave it here. Um, I don't know, maybe I'll make a, another harvesting machine and another flying machine. I don't know. We'll figure it out. I'll do. I'll do something, and then uh, we'll do that in the next episode. <laughs> if you uh, like this episode, please like and subscribe, and leave a comment below.